Welcome to Fantastic Fiber Friday. I have a lot of stuff to share with you. My most exciting news is that this week I was featured in Emily's Reviews. And oof, let me pull stuff out and move stuff out of the way. But I'm doing a yarn giveaway on Emily's Reviews and where we did like a write-up about the farm and what it is we do here at the Fibroma Bean. And I am giving away this skein of yarn. It, I don't know if you can see the sparkle. It's got gold sparkle in it. It's, super wa it's a super wash merino blend, um, 438 yards, I believe. In these amazing colors of scarlet and violet. And that kind of moves on to what I'm working on for Valentine's Day, which is I have some lovely lovelies that are going to be going into the store about the last week of January. Um, this one has uh, a silver sparkle through it. And I might as well just pull the rest of them out. Some more lovely lovelies. And what I'm going to do with these, what I thought would be really interesting, is to go ahead and make some matching fiber colorways. So for instance, I think I believe I've named this one Venus. I've got a spindle here rolling across my table. Um, this one I named Venus. Okay, and here is the Venus fiber. We have some beautiful Corydale in the two colors. And then some Firestar and some Mohair. And to that, since this one was this one is a gold colorway yeah this one's a gold colorway we're probably going to add haha -ha, you see what I'm saying pretties we'll add some um, some metallic gold and maybe just maybe I thought this would be really interesting too some metallic gold and maybe a little bit of ruby slip you see that? Let me hold it all up. See if I can. There we go. Like that. I hope you guys can see. But yeah, wouldn't that be like absolutely gorgeous? So that's kind of the lines on what I'm thinking. There's going to be a colorway to match every one of these yarns, and there's going to be an extra colorway which I'm calling Secret of Roddy. I pretty much named all these colorways after gods and goddesses of love. It seems very fitting for Valentine's Day. And as soon as I get these carded up, I will start showing them off. But they will be available um, starting the last week of January. After the giveaway at Emily's Reviews is over. These will be available for purchase. And so I don't remember what I've named them all. Um, probably in two weeks I'll have them back on here and I'll have all the names because I didn't actually write down the names so I'd remember them. But I do know I have Cupid and Eros and Aphrodite and Venus and Comediva. Yeah, that's all of them, I believe. Okay, and the other thing I want to talk about today is I'm absolutely, absolutely so happy for my friend Nicole Snow over at Darn Good Yarn. She won the small business grant competition that was run by FedEx. Yay, Nicole. It couldn't happen to a better person. I am so happy for her. And so I have been working on some stuff for her as well, which I had mentioned last week. And you saw the big pile of fiber on Monday. Well, there's more. This is stuff that I just pulled off the racks. So there's more that need to come off. But I just pulled this off quickly to show you. These will be available only over there. So... Um, Awesomely cool silk sheet. I think I got two colors of it in here. Silk sheet. Some rovings. And these ones are dry. I've been really crazy busy working on this stuff. And these ones need to go on the rack shit. They're just done. So I'm so happy for her. She won that contest. She kicked butt. It was amazing. And you will see more of this stuff over at Darn Good Yarn. So these are colorways specific to there. And I forgot to bring up 
Gosh darn it. I forgot to bring up my sweater because I actually have been working on my sweater. I have been working on my slippery slope sweater. I have the back completely done. I have over half the front done. I'm getting to the point where I have to split for because it's a v-neck you have to split for the armholes and the v and work two skeins of two two balls of yarn one on each side so getting ready to work on that there has been really not much spinning because i've been doing a lot of dyeing um and i think that's it i will remember the sweater next week hopefully i'll have the front done by then I hope you have a wonderful weekend, and I will see you next week. Bye.